Wait, did you see that? Did I glitch? Hello, YouTube. And Patreon. But welcome back to my face. Today we're watching season two, episode four of Konosuba. It's starting to be a mouthful. Last episode, Kazuma, Aqua, and kind of Megamine and her cat went out for a quest because they are broke as hell, boy. They found this quest. They got like a foot in on this quest. So it was like supposed to be a little bit easier. Kazuma and Aqua go into the dungeon. Megamine waited outside with her cat, started practicing seeing little moves. Anyways, it was pretty cute actually. Cosmo and Aqua went inside the dungeon. Aqua had a nice serenity about her when she was in this dungeon. She was working really hard. She actually was like stepping up as a goddess and protecting Cosmo. Uh, you see that she has like all these powers. Like she can see perfectly clearly in the dark. She uh, can sense darkness and energies and stuff like that. And Cosmo is like super confused of why she's being so productive. She also sends out like the dungeon owner, Keely, into the the heavens i guess to move on with his wife it was super sweet and then kazuma the negative nancy he is brings up the fact that hey aqua did you ever think about that you attract dead things so you actually cause me to be in more danger than I need to be. And she was like, listen here, Kazuma, don't you fucking leave me in this dungeon, I swear to God. But they um, they got a reward, they were happy. Kazuma did his stupid party trick, steal, and uh, stole some panties, which encouraged all the other men to just, I don't know, give their hand at it. And uh, they just started harassing the women, so. And that was the end of that episode. Uh, oh, and Darkness is still being tortured. She's still not, I'm, she keeps saying, I'll kill you like I, i'll kill you which doesn't sound super sexy so i'm not actually sure if she's enjoying it but maybe we'll find out this episode but yeah if you want to see this full episode uncut in its raw form make sure to check out my patreon the link is in the description below but without further ado let's start <laughs> Holding that bottle, girl. <gasps> oh, the scarf. What? Is that darkness? That was darkness. Why do you look like a maiden? His eyes are glowing. I'm Kazuma. Sure. She slaps her own dad. <laughs> she slaps her own dad. Wow. He's just trying to get rid of everyone. Why? That fucking voice. Does she at least get to take her cat with? Yes. There goes the cat. La Lantina. <laughs> the worst. What? In the. What is she wearing? La Latina. Oh, she's crazy. Let's see the handsome man. He looks more precious than handsome. What? 
を呼ばず魔王軍の手先に捕らえられ、組み伏せられて。それは魔王じゃない。私はそんな人生を。<笑>お前とうとう言い切りやがったな。大体。<笑> But he's respectful. ものすごくいいらしい。A decent character. あの曇りもないまっすぐな視線は。な<笑>めまわすようないやらしい視線で見られないのか。そうそうそうそうそんな視線で見てないし。<笑>誰に。できるだけ楽に人生を送りたいと人生舐めてるダメなやつがいい借金があれば申し分ないなそして働きもせずに酒ばかり飲んで俺がダメなのは世間が悪いと文句を言い空の瓶を私に投げてこういうのだおいダクネスそのいやらしい体を使ってちょっと金を稼いでこい畜生<笑>この女はもうダメだ<笑>では自己紹介を。Yo, what? Is he just freezing her ear? What? I don't know, Kazuma. Holy shit! おい。おい。ダクネス。見ろ。貴族たるもの。うん。そこの数はな。自称男女平等主義者。女。見合いを断るために来たんです。おう。でもあなたも見て気が変わった。おう。僕はあなたに興味が湧いた。おう。僕は
Dustin is, is, is very excited. I don't know what's her plan here. Honestly, after seeing that whole thing, Kazuma and Darkness might actually be made for each other because he can do this flawlessly. He doesn't even even try. He doesn't even need to try. He just satisfies her. And, uh, wow. I mean, it would make sense why now she was saying, I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Because it wasn't anything like that. She just, um, she just didn't want to wear a corset and be married off. She probably really wanted to be with the frogs instead. Yeah, I don't know what her plan is. Adoption, maybe? I don't know. Maybe, oh, maybe they could say Megamine is, like, actually her kid. Because <laughs> she's so little. That's, oh, that's crazy, though. I'm, I kind of stand it right now Kazuma and darkness because Kazuma just effortlessly just he's perfected the sexual harassment just so gross and darkness can't get enough of it her imagination's going wild whether anyone likes it or not and that guy was really nice other lord i mean he was a little too nice looking i think he was too sweet you know just a little too perfect she needs something a little bit more unhinged which apparently involves a 17 year old psychopath but you know that to each their own i'm excited to see how they plan to follow this out what is this tough love is often harder on the one giving it than on the recipient especially on their hearts so from now on Please allow me to live as a knight from your disobedient daughter, La Latina. I no longer wish to strike a member of my family who I care for. Did they just hit each other? I'm confused. Sometimes you forget Aqua is the oldest because of how stupid she is. Listen, she's at that age where she's not stupid. She just doesn't care enough to think about it. <laughs> at that age, I get it. She's like hundreds of years old because she's like a goddess, but thousands of years old. Either way, she's like, I'm too old to fucking care. So I'm just gonna be dumb. I hope I choose the same when I'm old and thousands of years old. All right, that was episode four. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode with me. If you want to see this entire episode make sure you check out my patreon and check out um all the episodes on there i always post on there first so if you want to see some future episodes that i haven't posted on youtube yet you might be able to find them there on patreon and if you haven't already make sure you smash that subscribe button for my youtube channel i post videos multiple times a week so if that sounds like it will suit your fancy go ahead and smash that subscribe button and push the notification button but that is it for today you guys Thank you so much for watching me, myself, and my face. And I will see you next time. Don't be a glitch. Go cause some goonery elsewhere. And I will see you then. Bye! Freezer fly was popping.